mummy thinks I need help. So if the problem is is critical or it's life threatening, then um, you need to come to A and E straight away. It's better if you can come in your own transport, like your own car. But if um, you really can't, then it's okay to call nine 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 for an ambulance. Um, but if it isn't life threatening, then it might be better to go somewhere else, like a minor injury unit um, or urgent care centre. If mum isn't sure what to do, then she could call 111 first or look online. If you're under five, then it's better to call. What happens when you come to A&E? So when you first come to A&E, you need to go to reception and register, and then you'll be called into triage. And triage is where we decide um, how urgent we need to give you treatment. And then after that, then you'll see one of our A&E clinicians and then you'll get some treatment. Okay. What is an urgent treatment centre? So an urgent treatment centre is somewhere you can go if you have, uh, if you've hurt your head, or you've got minor cuts, and um, broken bones, or are feeling unwell. What happens if my mummy thinks I need help? Well, if it's a life-threatening emergency, then you must come to A&E straight away. But if mummy wasn't sure, and you are under five, then she could phone 111. Or if you're over five, go on the 111 website and then you can get advice about the, where the best place to get treatment is. Well, that was accident and emergency. I hope you learned as much as me. Join me next time as I delve further into our health services.